What's your name? Adam. And you, you, how long have you worked at Momentum? I worked for Momentum for six years. Six years. So you're one of the younger workers. I am, yes. And what are some of the issues that, that you are dealing with in relation to the strike and the, for your future here? Uh, me personally, uh, my future retirement from here has been compromised to start. Uh, health benefits are plummeting. Um, things along those lines. How much were you paying for your health care before you went out on strike? Probably more than average. <laughs> you don't know the specific number? Not exactly. Yeah. But it was an issue? It was, yes. Yeah. You have a family or you're a single? I do not. But I do serve in the military and I'm back and forth between the hazards there and the hazards here. It'd be nice to be helped out with a, with a future health care. Right. Right. Um, and were you, were you a production worker or a uh, I was, yes. I was production a, worker? I was uh, one of the core operators running uh, reactors and dealing with many of the hazardous chemicals. Uh-huh. Um, and how, how do you feel about the safety situation around the plant now? As of right now, you have unskilled operators from God who knows where in there doing things that have taken me years to, to get down to 100% accuracy. And you can't just come in here and think you know what you're doing and do it safely. It right. takes time. Some of these systems will take years and years to learn. And what what kind of community support and labor support have you seen so far uh, around so the So far flight? we've seen, uh, I believe uh, we've had firemen come out. Uh, I know the town is pretty much behind us. Uh, we've had other labor unions talking with our president and supporting us and what, we, uh, what we're doing out here. And uh, a lot of local um, companies have donated things, food, uh, things along those lines. As you can see, we have the wood that's helping keeping us warm out here during the evening times. Uh, it gets cold out here in New York, especially this northeast area. Well, what would you, what would you say finally, uh, the last question, um, to other workers who are facing situations like yours in terms of solidarity and that kind of thing? Stick together. Yeah. Stick together. That's all you can do. And fortunately for the company, we're out here meeting each other. I might not know somebody from out back being out here. It's, it's making us even more closer. You know, the brotherhood is definitely tighter now than it was a couple months ago when we voted no. Thanks a lot. Uh, could you repeat your name? Adam. Adam. Thanks a lot, Adam. Thank Absolutely. you very much.